Welcome back to another video guys. Today I'm gonna update you guys on my Blu-ray collection. But first I just wanted to say thank you for all the subscribers that have been subscribing to the channel lately. Uh, we reached to 300 and that may be a little to some people but I know this, is, this channel will grow in time. So I am just excited for everything to come this year. Uh, and also to see this collection of Back of Me grow. This is a brand new um, shelf that I bought. It's called the Atlantic Media Shelf. And before I had my, um, my 4Ks in this bookshelf, which was pretty small. Like it was just a regular bookshelf, but I did go to Best Buy and I did pick up the Atlantic. So this thing holds a lot of Blu-rays. I think it's around 643. And, I and with all my, uh, you know, like all my 4Ks, I thought I was gonna fill up a lot more, but I'm not even halfway, so I still have so much room to like put um, more 4Ks. It's coming out nice. Uh, I already did a 4K collection, so if you haven't seen that, go inside the my videos and you'll see the 4K collection. Um, I'll probably make another video collection uh, as soon as the end of the year because, you know, it shows the progress of it. Also, I did want to do a movie room tour. Um, I'm still in the process of uh, putting up posters and setting up more shelves and stuff like that. Once I get done with all that stuff, I will do a home video or home theater setup uh, room tour or movie room tour. I'm hoping to get to get more stuff for this movie room. But um, yeah, today we're going to do the uh, 4K Blu-ray update, uh, what I picked up. Um, I have been trying to catch up on the 4Ks that I missed out the last couple weeks. So we'll start off with that. I picked up Beverly Hills Cops. I've um, never seen it, so yeah. That's a, that's one thing that I do like about 4K. A lot of these are being released on 4K, and I haven't seen them when I was growing up, so it, it gives me a chance to pick it up. Also, I do like that it comes with a slip cover, so that's a win right there. Um, usually the 4K slips are really nice anyway, so um, yeah, that's what one thing I do love about 4K. Now, before I started collecting 4K, I didn't even have a 4K player, but I did, um, it does come with the Blu-ray, so I decided picking up the 4Ks with the Blu-ray for now, watch them, and then once I did get my 4K TV and all that, I would watch the 4K and I don't have to double dip later on. So yeah, um, Beverly Hills Cops, never seen it. Uh, I hear it's good. Most of my buys actually are uh, blind buys because I don't really pay to well watch them. I would just pick them up on physical media and then I'll watch them on my own time, so yeah. Um, next up we do have is Iron Man, the first one on 4K. Uh, when I was putting my 4K collection up, I did notice that I didn't have Iron Man 1 for some reason. And I don't know how I missed it, but I thought I had a, a still book. But I do have all the Marvels now. I, I, I thought it was, a, it was just Iron Man that I was missing. But now I have it with the slipcover. So yeah. Next up we have... Uh, v for Vendetta. Really like that slipcover. You got Natalie Portman right there. Uh, really nice. See, this is what I love about 4K. The slipcovers, they always um, do fantastic artwork on them. And uh, yeah, here we go. Here's the back. I, I think I watched half of this movie, but I hear a lot of the stuff that's going on in this movie is most of it, it's like happening right now with our government and all that. So it's pretty trippy stuff. Um, next up I picked up is Bill and Ted Face the Music. This got Keanu Reeves. I've never seen any of these. I do need to pick up the first two. I, I know this is the third movie, so I can't, I don't know if I can watch this or I have to watch the other ones first, but I'm probably going to wait till I watch the other ones. I'll have to pick those up. All right, next up I picked up, uh, The Owners on Blu-ray. Really like the slipcover. Haven't seen it. But I do like her from uh, Game of Thrones, Arya Stark. Um, I'm, I want to see how her acting is, is outside of uh, Game of Thrones. She did really good in Game of Thrones. Um, I did watch The New Mutants, and for me, it was an okay movie. Uh, so I'm not sure how she's going to act in this one. Hopefully, it's good, though. All right. I haven't heard anything about this movie. It's called uh, Widows. And... It's got a good cast though. It's got um, Colin Farrell, Liam Neeson, uh, Michelle Rodriguez, you know, to name a few. So uh, a couple actors that I like, so I thought I'd check it out. Had the slipcover, so yeah. 
Uh, I did watch this one on um, Netflix. So actually, I did watch this one before I picked it up, but I heard good things, and I want to check it out on Netflix, and that's Ava. Uh, I do like Colin Farrell. Um, see, Jessica Chastain. But yeah, this is a good, this is a good movie. It's kind of like a assassin movie. So if you're into those kind of movies, like assassination movies, uh, you'll probably like this one. Sorry for the, um, the traffic outside. It's like, I live by a busy street, so it's always cars coming by and they're always like bumping music and stuff. But yeah, this is Ava. Uh, I heard they're gonna make another one of these, a uh, second one, cause uh, this one did really good. So hopefully it does get a second movie. Uh, yeah, check that one out. All right, this one is Days of Thunder on 4K. I haven't watched a lot of Tom Cruise movies, so I'm trying to get into more of his movies. Um, the only one I watched was War of the Worlds, and I haven't even seen any of the Mission Impossible, so I'm trying to catch up on all of his movies. Tom Cruise, um, yeah, I heard a lot of good things on this movie, so can't wait to check this one out. That uh, Let's see, we got next up, your Highness on Blu-ray. I believe this is gonna get a new uh, re-release in the next couple weeks. Uh, I did find it at a store, so I just picked it up. It came with the slipcover anyway, so yeah. I don't know, it looks like I'm into like the medieval times and it looks like just like a fun comedy to put on when you're bored. Um, not expecting too much of it, but. Uh. All right, next up is Tenet on 4K. Really nice slipcover. Uh, like I said, I've heard you have to watch this movie a couple, like maybe like twice or something to get it. It's kind of hard to understand. Uh, it's Christopher Nolan film, so that's that. But yeah, I can't wait to check this one out on 4K. I'm sure it's gonna look amazing. I heard it sounds amazing. It's really loud. So yeah. All right, I did pick this one up. I double dipped on it. Uh, I have the still book, but I wanted the slip cover too. So I just picked up Total Recall again um, with the slip cover. And yeah, that's that's one thing about collecting is like, you have to have the slip cover or you gotta have the still book. Sometimes you have to have both, so. All right, next up, Coming to America on 4K. Really, really nice artwork on this slip cover. Um, I heard amazing things on this one as well, and the sequel is going to come out. So I need to hurry up and watch this one as well before the sequel comes out. Heard it's a really good comedy. Eddie Murphy uh, does a good uh, performance in this, so can't wait to check it out. Now, my last pickup is going to be uh, Top Gun with Tom Cruise. Like I said, I'm, I remember, I think I watched this like a long time ago when I was little, but I can't remember it, so I'm going to have to rewatch it. Like I said... Another sequel that's going to be coming out, Top Gun. So I want to watch it before um, that comes out as well. Um, yeah, so really nice slip cover for that one. So yeah, there's that. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, drop a like and drop a comment down below. Let me know what you guys picked up. Also, I do want to give you guys a heads up. I am going to be picking up a tripod with the light so that I don't have to be holding the uh, phone anymore. It helps me out and I just want to make better content for you guys. So yeah, hopefully within the next two weeks, I should be able to pick that up. Um, yeah, thank you for all the subscribers that you guys have been subscribing. Everybody that gives the likes and all that stuff. I'll see you guys next time. Later.